big challenges like food and energy security are only going to become more difficult um, with pressures like climate change and changing populations. And agriculture is right at the forefront of addressing these. Innovation in agriculture, it's not just about technologies, but it's about looking at innovative governance, how we can make our food systems more resilient, how do we speed up the process of innovation, what are we innovating for and how do we respond from an agricultural perspective to big shocks? What are the sort of innovations that we require to help maintain and enhance our agricultural productivity? The sorts of students that we, we look for are students that have a broad range of skills but are interested in applying those skills in the context of agriculture. When I started at the ANU, I actually started uh, in economics and sort of sustainable development rather than in the agricultural space. I guess sort of from my economics perspective, it sort of gave me more of a big picture sort of perspective on agriculture. I was really interested in not only sort of the, you know, the plant or livestock side of things on the farm level, but more so on the whole market side of things. And I think sort of the language that I had learned in economics gave me a different perspective and how to use that in the agricultural space, which is really Really great that I was able to transfer those skills from what seemed like such a different space but really was so interconnected. During the last year of my degree we actually did a six month project working with an external partner through SEAT um, looking at renewable energy systems for an off-grid piggery. It brought through the real world challenges into the engineering space and allowed us to analyse um, systems that would actually work well for everyday agricultural use and look at that on a systems level thinking rather than just looking at the energy separately. When we're working with industry they're telling us that they need a different type of graduate. They need graduates with skills from all different areas. So these are not the traditional skills that you might consider in agriculture. We need people who are real problem solvers and thinkers. We need engineers, computer scientists, um, people from all different degrees and we need them to be able to work together. We also love to have industry partners come and work with us to teach our students and engage with the next generation. Uh, our students yeah, come from all different backgrounds, so some have a connection to agriculture, they've grown up on the land, whereas others have probably never seen a sheep before. So, so that's been really fun.